insane. insane. My heart is pounding. <laughs> Steph, there's a very real chance that you awoke something in Diane. <laughs> Wouldn't be the first time. <laughs> I know I'm cracking up, but that was legit terrifying. <laughs> I hope it was worth the risk. Password protected. Guess I'm not surprised. I'll bring this to Riley, see if she's willing to help. She's a whiz at computer stuff. In the meantime, we have a LARP to do. Grab your hat and meet me at the park. And don't forget your guitar, okay? One question. When the LARP's over, can I keep the hat? I'd say that all depends on how you do. Damn, gauntlet thrown. <laughs> Did you finish the thing? Yeah, barely. It took me all night. I haven't carved like that in ages. All right, I need to grab my guitar and the hat that Steph got me. Wow. Typhon officially clears Typhon of any wrongdoing in death of local man at the hands of Typhon explosions. Ducky's gift to me for finding his booze. It's, um, it's a unique expression of gratitude. I found some really cute photos of Gabe and Ethan on this thing. I haven't beat Steph a single time. That just means I'm overdue for a win, right? I know this is Ethan's copy, but... I'm level 73, and I'm not stopping. Steph bought this for me as a gag, but I kind of developed a taste for it. I don't even know if I'm doing this right, but it felt like I had to do something. Life in Haven would be a lot worse without these two weirdos. I feel like I kept the hat in here. Only one way to find out. Huh. There it is. Half person, half dump truck. I feel you. Yeah. I don't need to know what that was for. Another one of Gabe's hidden cans. To work. Oh, hi there. Now what do you unlock? Steph knows how to LARP on a budget. I hope Ethan likes it. Oh, shit. The feather on the hat must have fallen off. Maybe I can find it. Gabe's last effects from the coroner. Pike dropped it off a few days ago. Yes, I've been avoiding looking through it. Okay. You can take the kid out of juvie. Oh. 
one match left. I don't know why, but this must have been really special to Gabe. Never know when you'll need a light. I'm not giving up yet, Gabe. I better find that feather. Steph is a stickler for details. A housewarming gift from Eleanor. She said Gabe loved these little dudes. No sunglasses, though. We're one step closer now. Steph, I will murder you. Wish I'd taken Steph's advice. Ugh. Wow. Steph is a rock star for putting this together. Ethan is gonna flip. Maybe that key will finally reveal your secrets. This must have been Gabe's. long list, and I bet he would have gotten through it. Wow, Gabe. Still finding ways to break my heart, huh? A dire rat joined your party. One day, I'll stop being a freeloader. For now, I'm just grateful. Best roommate I've ever had.
Yikes. This garden is looking gnarly. I wonder how many times Gabe got stoned up here and stared at these. Guessing it was more than zero. I haven't played for anyone else in years. That was a good night. So far, Ryan is the only one that uses this. Maybe I should just gift it to him. Ugh, you need a lot of help, don't you? Ugh, not much better. Maybe I can clean you up a bit. Well, it's better than nothing. Leave it to me to wreck Gabe's bike on my first ride. At least Ryan had a good laugh about it. My weapon of choice. Every time I listen to this record, it takes me right back to that moment with Gabe. Stuff was right. These chicks rock. Of course I'm investing all my tips into expanding my record collection. Maybe I should put something on. This feather separates the buskers from the bards. Okay. I better find Ethan right away. Alex the Bard, ready to serve. Time to head out.
Hey. I don't need, like, cheering up or whatever. Okay, so maybe this wasn't the most subtle idea, but... Gabe was so excited to LARP with you. I bet he'd really want you to do it. I do want to do this. It's just... <sighs> Everyone's been working so hard. And if I'm not happy, they'll all be disappointed. Must be weird having a bunch of adults pressuring you to dress up in a costume and act like you're having fun. Yeah, especially my mom. She always looks so <sighs> sad. Cause I'm like bummed out, but I can't just pretend. So, don't pretend. Just be yourself. Or yourself with a foam sword and a funny hat. But what if I'm still, you know, not having fun? Then don't. That's fine too. No one will be disappointed in you for being you. All right. But I don't want to do it alone. You have to help me. Of course. Thanor, the monster slayer. Thanks to the gods and all the heavens you've come. I am in desperate need of a great hero. Could you be the one? Please, tell me of your exploits. Uh, there's a bunch of stuff. Maybe my bard can sing something about me. Oh, sure. A horde of ogres! That's a lot. Thanor slew them with a single shot. My goodness. You must be Thanor's bard, Alexandra, whose songs have magical powers. It sounds like you are exactly the heroes I need. My name is King Tabor. The age of monsters has come upon my kingdom. Horrible creatures stalk the streets. My people live in constant fear. But there's hope. An ancient prophecy describes three mysterious gems known as soul jewels that can save us all. I need you to go search the kingdom, survive whatever's out there, and bring me back those jewels. Do you understand? Yeah. Yes. Good. Then you must go. Now. My people are counting on you. Should we start with the main road? Okay. Time to find some jewels. <laughs> 